If you're considering using Facebook ads for your tour or activity, here are five reasons maybe you should think of a different platform and not use Facebook. Number one, you're just planning on boosting posts from your page. This is actually a really poor way to get real results from Facebook. Facebook has different ways that they show ads to people and if you're just boosting posts, typically what you're gonna do is you're gonna get a lot of likes, you'll maybe get some shares, you'll get some comments, maybe you get some page likes, but overall you don't get a lot of traffic to your website or you, you could not get a lot of traffic. And typically that if you're not getting traffic to your website, you're probably not getting more bookings. So the return that you're gonna get on that investment is often very low. Now Facebook can be a really great place to be, but just boosting posts typically isn't the best strategy. The second reason you don't wanna advertise on Facebook is if you don't have a mobile friendly site. Now, hold on really quick. This statistic is huge. About 92% of Facebook traffic is from a mobile device. That means if you don't have a mobile friendly website, 92% of those people are gonna bounce. They're gonna be out of there because your website's gonna be a pain. So if you don't have a mobile friendly website, fix that problem first and then consider Facebook. The third reason you might wanna reconsider advertising on Facebook for your tour is if you don't have good quality images or more importantly, you don't have video. On Facebook, advertisements with really low quality images just don't perform. Even really good quality images that are static images and not video are not performing as well as they used to. Now, if you have video and it's good quality, that's something to consider. But if you don't have video at all, work on getting some video. It's so much more powerful. You can use that video organically. You can use it on Instagram. You can put it on your website and it does so much more for your business. So if you don't have good images and more importantly, you don't have video, then don't try to advertise on Facebook. Number four, if you're considering advertising on Facebook and your tour is already scraping to get by and you're hoping that if you advertise, you'll get more business, it's probably not the best bet for you. Generally speaking, if you're not profitable, trying to get more traffic and paying for those customers is just gonna result in a less profitable company and you're gonna to continue to go on a downward trend. So if you're in a place where really you just need more sales to get by, if you already have some sales and you just don't know how to turn that into a profit, advertising on Facebook just isn't gonna be for you. You need to talk to somebody like Ingrid Edstrom from Polymath, polymath.com, I'll link her below. She can really help tours become profitable and then you can use that profit to advertise on Facebook as a way to scale your business. Number five, you don't wanna be advertising on Facebook if you don't have the time to invest in learning the platform, learning how to optimize, or paying someone to do it. So that means if you have someone on your team or hiring an agency, if you don't have that, then don't try to advertise on Facebook. Typically what's gonna happen is you're gonna invest some money, maybe you put some recurring ads up, and they're gonna start spending and you're gonna forget about it. And with it just sitting there, it's gonna spend money and probably not return. I mean, you could get lucky, but most time, that's not gonna happen. If you don't have the time to learn Facebook and watch it, and optimize it over time and learn uh, what to do with the data and how to shift when you're seeing results come in, or you don't have the, the resources to pay someone to do it, whether it's an employee or an agency, then really you should invest that money elsewhere, make your company more profitable, and then take that money and invest in hiring somebody, whether an agency or somebody else to look over your Facebook ads. Otherwise, you're just gonna start throwing your money away. All right, so if you were considering advertising on Facebook, I hope this helped you. If you have any questions about Facebook advertising, comment below, I'll be happy to help. If you wanna see more videos like this, please like and subscribe, click the little bell icon, because we have a lot more content coming out like this, and uh, hopefully I'll see you soon. Thanks so much, bye.